Hello, Purdue University. Welcome on board the International Space Station. I have you loud and clear. What are some of the experiments that you are working on right now? And how is your work supporting or adding to research efforts back on Earth? Our cells actually age faster when we're in microgravity, and so researchers on Earth are able to study um, aging and uh, its effects on the immune system uh, faster and in a way that they aren't able to on Earth. I've also been involved in another experiment called fiber optic production where we are investigating um, creating new optical fibers in space that are better than those created on Earth. What's it like going up on a Soyuz rocket? Launch day is one of my favorite days of my entire life. Once we sat down in our seats and got strapped in, it was like very similar to training until a couple hours later uh, when we're ready for launch the rocket just suddenly start the whole thing starts vibrating and you suddenly realize like uh, this is <laughs> this time we're actually leaving earth what is the most beautiful thing you've seen in outer space sitting in cupola um, during a night pass and watching city lights go by underneath us and then looking out at this just vast sea of stars um, you really feel like you're in an ocean of stars what is one thing that you were surprised by the most when you got to ISS even after this extensive training they can't train us for microgravity so when we first get to space we don't know how we're going to feel or how we're going to react or really what it's like you know when you're living and working um, in an environment where one minute you can be on the ground and one minute you can be working on the wall I thought it would get old, but every day there, I still have moments where I'm floating through a module and I'm just like, I can't believe this is real life. What advice do you have for aspiring engineers? Know that it's okay to make mistakes or fail. How you react in the moment and afterwards um, in the time that follows is more important, I think, than the mistake itself. Thank you guys uh, for speaking with me. It's a pleasure to get to talk to everyone in West Lafayette and Boiler Up. A lot of times in engineering, we can get sort of caught up in the facts and figures, the theory of it all. But at the end of the day, it's about the human factors. It's about the astronauts doing the research um, on the ISS that kind of get the applications of everything that we work towards. So it's really nice to be able to see sort of the end product of all of what we're learning.